Readings from the Berwick Bi-Monthly, Events in Berwick for May. The highlights this month are the Candidates' Night on Tuesday the 17th and the Memorial Day Parade on Monday the 29th. Meet the candidates on Wednesday, May 17th at 6.30 in the Burgess Meeting Room at the Town Hall. There are two open seats for the select board. The candidates are Lisa M. Chase, Larry E. Rendell, Philip A. Roy, and Thomas J. Wright. There is one open seat for school board, and Margaret Wheeler is the only candidate on that ballot. Berwick's annual Memorial Day parade will begin at Berwick Town Hall at 11 a.m. on the 29th. The parade will feature the Noble High School and Middle School bands, veterans, scout troops, and the Burke Fire Department. The parade route will run from Sullivan Street to Wilson and Allen Streets and stop at Lord's Cemetery for a short service. The parade will then make its way down Sawmill Hill to the Burke Summersworth Bridge for a brief ceremony honoring those lost at sea. Then the parade will reconvene in Sullivan Square for a roll call of Berwick veterans who lost their lives in our wars. The memorial speaker for this year is Reverend Stephen Moody. The parade is hosted and organized by the Charles S. Hatch Post No. 79. In advance of Memorial Day, members of the Hatch Post will be placing new flags on veterans' graves on Wednesday the 24th from 5 to 7 p.m. It's Teacher Appreciation Week from the 8th to the 12th. Sunday, May 14th, is Mother's Day. Don't forget this one. Perhaps your mother was a teacher? The third in the Let's Go Gardening series will be presented by Amrita Cottrell and Dennis Jackson at the library on May the 16th at 6 p.m., just in time for spring, if it ever stops raining. And follow that up with the Burrock Public Library's community plant sale, Saturday, May the 20th, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m., Donations of plants are needed. Go to berwick.lib.me.us for more information. Here are the weekly library programs. On Saturday afternoon, May 20th, Cub Scout Pack 313 meets for a night at the museum, a trip to the McAuliffe Shepherd Discovery Center in Concord. If you have a child interested in joining Cub Scouts, contact Don Spinney at donspinn44 at aol.com. Here are this month's municipal meetings. The annual Noble High School Band Concert takes place on Wednesday the 24th. The annual Noble High School Choir Concert takes place on Tuesday the 30th. That is followed on Wednesday the 31st with the 8th grade band and choir concert. All concerts begin at 7 p.m. at Noble High School with the doors opening at 6.30 p.m. Here's a good one. The second annual Muddy Mile takes place on Thursday and Friday, May 25th and 26th, sponsored by the Burke PTO. The Muddy Mile is an all-inclusive event for all Hussey School and Knowlton School students, teachers, and staff. It takes place during school hours and it is open to homeschool children too. I expect you'll get muddy. And plan ahead. The annual Burrock Car Show, sponsored by Charles S. Hatch Post number 79, takes place on Sunday, June the 4th from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. Last year, over 150 cars were present. And later this summer, bring your lawn chairs to Sullivan Square, the summer concert event on Saturday, August the 19th. Come for some great fun and great music. Subscribe to the Berwick Bi-Monthly today. Keep up with all the events and meetings in the town of Berwick. The Berwick Bi-Monthly link is on the town of Berwick's homepage at www.berwickmaine.org. You can subscribe to the Berwick Bi-Monthly on that page. Printed copies of the Berwick Bi-Monthly can also be picked up at the Town Hall, the Berwick Public Library, and the Berwick Post Office. The Berwick Bi-Monthly is sponsored by Envision Berwick and is edited by Marie Miller. I'm Lisa Hustis, and have a great day. Hold on, hold on. It's me again. This just in. The school district budget hearing will take place on May 25th at 6.30 p.m. at Noble High School. The MSAD 60 superintendent and the school board will present the budget for the Berwick, Lebanon, and North Berwick school systems. Come learn about what is in the budget and ask questions. 
voting to approve the budget along with the Town of Berwick budget, two select board seats and one school board seat will take place on Tuesday, June the 13th. We announced earlier that the Berwick walkers had a walk on Monday, May the 1st. Well, you haven't missed it, the walkers walk every Monday. So take a perambulation around town, Mondays at 10.30. It's a different route each week, so call the library for details, 207-698-5737. All levels of walkers and wheelchair users are encouraged to join. The walkers are sponsored by Burrick for a Lifetime. Speaking of roads, the Route 4 Safety Study will have draft concepts to share soon. This study is reviewing the entire Route 4 corridor for safety improvements. The improvements proposed will include turn lanes and raised median islands. Here is a rendering of the new playground being built at Memorial Field by the Town of Burrick Recreation Department. The equipment has been ordered and soon will be installed. Earlier this month, the Burrick Police Benevolent Association hosted a successful cornhole tournament fundraiser, which included several raffles. One raffle is still open. Win two tickets to the Zac Brown Band concert on September the 2nd at Meadowbrook in Guilford, New Hampshire. Anyone interested in purchasing tickets can stop by the Burke Police Department during the week from 8.45 to 4.30. Raffle tickets are $10 each. You may also purchase tickets at the Burke Car Show on Sunday, June the 4th. And an update from the edge. Everyone has noticed the construction, and here are the details. 12 Sullivan Street, which is across from the town hall, there are just two business spaces left for lease. 8 Main Street, across from the old fire station, will have 10 one-bedroom apartments, posted for lease soon, and two commercial units. Construction should be completed on that this summer or early fall. 3 School Street, which is across from Kenny Bunk Savings Bank, will have four two-bedroom and two one-bedroom apartments, plus Aroma Joe's coffee house and one other commercial space. And through the center of it all, Main Street is underway. See you in June with the next Burrick Bi-Monthly.